Hey guys, before we get into the video, just want to say a quick few words. Thank you to all our affiliate links and sponsors. Check them out down below. Special thanks to AtomicDefense.com forward slash TonyTokes115. Use TonyTokes115 at checkout and get yourself some armor today. Also, a big thank you to MediTacKits.com forward slash TonyTokes115. Use TonyTokes115 at checkout and be protected today and get uh, medical equipment to save a life. Also, big shout out to SS Airsoft. Link down in the description box below. Check them all out and more. Now, on to the video. Bitch, what up? what up? They say they on they block, it's time to slide. Fuck them up. Hey, look, bro, walking up, masked up, suited up. Hey, catch them by that stove, up the pole, shoot it up. Hey, switch up on the Glock, make them hop, double dust. Hey, look, bro, over cold, he got two poles, double duck. Hey, Glizzy, that's my dog, he'll catch you, bite you up. Hey, treat the ops like blunts, hit a cut, light them up. Hey, don't hype him up, cause he'll die. How your whole block cry, his balloons in the sky. Not a ops want me dead, so I tell him, come try. But I slide first, all they hear is fa, fa, fa. That's that nick, nigga. Hey, that's how I'm coming, bitch Like a track star, I'm on my block Really running shit, I do this shit in real life Boy, this shit is not a skit Remember putting tape up on the mag Just to make it fit I remember sliding every day I wasn't at the park I ain't had no lighter But I really had to make it spark Keep that eye on me Like my real name was Tony Stark All you see is spark, spark, spark I'm trying to leave a mark, nigga Hey, bitch, what up? what up? They say they on they block It's time to slide Hey guys, what up? It's Apex. Quick little review today. Figured, you know, this I had a few like cheaper airsoft toys in my collection. And this one was one of those bring me back to when I first started airsoft because one of my first airsoft guns was actually a non-blowback CO2 gun. And it was the Crossman Z11, not the C11, it was the Z1. And it was the basic bitch one, but it was the zombie model. And funny story on how I got that, I won the, a scratcher and I got it before, I, and I got it from Walmart. And apparently, like when I went in the next day to go get CO2, I was 16 at the time. So it was like, okay, so I couldn't buy CO2 until I was 18. I was like looking at the guy to my left, like that guy literally sold me the gun yesterday. <laughs> So, fun story on how I sort of got my first airsoft gun, too. But uh, today, we are reviewing the Plan Beta. Uh, they call it the Predator Target. I call it the Norinco Glock. And uh, if you saw in the opening, big giant star on it. <laughs> but um, let's get into it. There's a few color options. This one, I got two of these. Pistols from an Evite swag pack. Um, this was a while ago, and um, for I got basically two of them. So, and a few other things that I gave away. So, you know what? Figured, let me review it. So, basically, who's Plan Beta? They've been unactive for a while, but they were one of the first people to make. Um, how do you say, like, Swiss Arms used to make, like, this package that came with a laser, like, a cheap red dot sight, etc. It literally, Plan Beta, they made, like, this um, cheap laser sight that had a camera in it instead of um, a laser. And um, then they did a few Springers. Uh, um, Al actually reviewed a Springer from them. Um, check that out on hit on the, tri on the AAA Airsoft Media channel. But uh, this is... I guess one of their newer offerings? No real info on this guy, so basically let's get into it. It is literally just a non-blowback CO2 uh, like Glock knockoff. It feels almost like a CZ and a Glock had a baby. Uh, there is no like painted sights, but you know, it's a Glock frame like style. Um, when you, um, Allen key comes in the box, but that's where your CO2 goes stick mag um there's two ways you can load it you can just either speed load it from the top which is what i personally do or you can pull down the bb follower and then there's a little hole that you can fill like that 
Um, safety is on the inside of the trigger, right for dead. Other side for safe. As you can see, the barrel does come out of the gun until boom, and you shoot. FPS was in the 400s. Uh, it did fluctuate depending on how I did shooting, but it is a 400 FPS, one jewel gun. So this is definitely more for outdoors or uh, whichever field allows this style of uh, pistol and kinetic energy. Pretty much all I can say about this gun is it's a fun little plinker gun and if you're outdoors and need a sidearm for say within pistol range engagements, this one will do you fine. And honestly it's super cheap that if anything it's a fun little toy that you can give someone to as their first beginner gun or what have you. Like I said, one of these was my first beginner gun and it taught me you know, the general basics. So something cheap, something light. By the way, this gun is super light. This is light, one of my lightest guns in my collection, honestly. This is even lighter than some of the um, CO2 guns back in the day like that. This gun for me was more of a memory trip than really a true review. Let's just say an overview of the platform, but it was nice to take a trip back in time and see this uh, see a platform from a new angle so we should say but um yeah definitely can't wait to do the next reviews so stay tuned for more content coming soon this one was just like a little fun little review before my birthday so anyways guys hope you enjoyed th today's video stay tuned for more we got three other reviews plus so content keeps going and going guys so see you on the next one Deuces. Thank you for watching. Check out all the other stuff we do, including the po AOKO podcast, as well as our whatnot showings and more down in the description. Thank you guys again for watching. Deuces.